too darn easy, let me tell you. Apparently that one's been off before. Because I was ready to put up a fight with that son of a gun and uh, boy, she just slid right off. Gotta like that. Well, I tell you what, I really thought that was going to be a battle of wits. And I mean, you never know how these things are going to come off. But I got to tell you that this nut here actually broke loose relatively easy. Which I was really surprised. But what really surprised me is how simple that thing broke loose. I mean, it just flew off. Very little pressure at all. But anyway, that's why I'm replacing it. And what do we got here? We got a brand new part. Ooh, made in Turkey. Of course, it's got two labels on it. I may have to pull that other label off if it is the right one. But here's what we ended up with. $127.55 for second hand there for a brand new pulley all right uh, got the new pulley on uh, like I said the old one came off real easy uh, I'm putting the axle back on now I well doing it by myself um, kind of need both hands and I just wanted to get in there and get it done and completely forgot about recording it but you saw how it came off it actually went back on the same way pretty easy I'm just going to tighten up some bolts now all right got her back to standing on her own two feet um, did get the rims done uh, this part was too heavy to load in my truck myself so since I plan on painting all the uh, gunmetal gray on this thing this summer after I can pressure wash it I think all I'm going to end up doing is painting this part here where the uh, radiator sits because that'll be inaccessible got the radiator cleaned up um, well let's see go to the side with the light got her all cleaned out there's no debris at all in there and we're gonna go ahead and use some what have we got here we got rust-oleum specialty ultra high heat good to 1200 degrees if that poor thing ever gets that warm then I got bigger problems in my paint peeling off well folks just got back from the uh, implement store Look at what I picked up. Parked kind of close to the fence. Don't know if you can see it or not. Picked me up a mower. Got a really good deal on it. It was one of their uh, rentals. And uh, it's only, it only went out on rent four or five times. It's not all beat up. It's got one you can see that one front bar for a three point hitch on the other side there is a little bit bent but that's not that big of an issue I'll pull that chunk off and heat her up with the torch and bend it back into shape and if that doesn't work then I'll just buy a new arm or I actually have some of that half inch steel I'll just make a new arm or actually that's not even half inch that's like three eighths but I have a chunk of that so anyway, it's a year old, it was used for one season, and I got it for half the price of a brand new one. I think that was a pretty good buy.